What's up, ladies and gents? Sinister 01 is back, and we have got more Grand Theft Auto 5. Possibly the last mission. I am not 100% positive, but it is the last mission, as at least it says on the uh, setting screen. So, uh, with that being said, this car just tried to kill me. Um, we're going to make our way to uh, this next mission here. It's for Franklin. And you see that we still have the L's up. That's the uh, assassination missions, but like I said, we will start to do those whenever um, we're actually completely done with the story missions as we're going to play some golf, we're going to do some tennis, we're going to do all kinds of activities. It's going to be great. But uh, I want to thank everyone for liking the videos. Thank you for you know commenting, for favoriting, and all that kind of stuff, sharing them. I uh, really do appreciate all the likes, all the comments, and just... Uh, the general conversations that we have all had playing some GTA 5 and I, I really do appreciate it. This game took a very, very long time to uh, to complete. I mean, just complete alone then, of course, with the editing and then everything else that you got to do, the uploading and all that. Um, probably if I would, wasn't recording, I could have had this finished within like two days. I mean, but um, with life and everything else, of course, it's taken just over a week. But... We have finally done it. We are near the end, and it's uh, been one hell of a ride. Let's see, what time is it? 16.49. Right, so it looks like this next mission is probably going to be a nighttime mission. Hopefully it won't be in the rain, though. That would kind of suck. What the hell is this guy doing? Take up the whole damn lane, brother. Oh, so excited to see how this is going to play out. I love characters and games, and I get um, I get very attached to their stories and all that kind of stuff. So hopefully, I'm going to like whatever ending that this game is going to throw at me. But my guess is um, there's got to be a way that we can have all three of them still be alive, because that way you can still choose to be all three of them um, when you're playing more, you know, even after the end and stuff. But only Franklin's missions are still up and you don't need to complete so it is possible that uh, the other two could die but I'm not really sure about Franklin so I guess we'll find out all right ladies and gents here we are let's do it Slick, it's me! <laughs> what the fuck do you want? You got my money, punk? Hey, you got some coconut water or something like that? I need some electrolytes. Damn, it's kind of warm, isn't it? <sighs> Man, you got a death wish or something. Am I supposed to kill you now? Oh, no, bro. Not me. Nah. Oh, yeah! But that's my boy. Yeah, but that's my boy. He has betrayed everyone he's ever known. He's got you involved with the federal government, and he's messed up several business ventures of mine. He has got to go. And you know what? I'd like to say that this isn't personal, but it is personal. But the feds, man. The feds have told me to kill Trevor, and I obviously can't kill them both. The feds. Steve Haynes, Dave Norton. I own shopping malls. I would not employ those two clowns in. And I make one phone call, their careers, they are over. So you're going to A, listen to some 50 grand a year pension hunter, or B, a billionaire, who even the president lets finger his wife, or C, try and be really stupid and save those two idiot mentors of yours and have everybody in the goddamn state crawling up your ass. A, B, or C. Time's ticking, pal. Beep, beep, beep. And your answer is... Man, you know what? Man, fuck you. Genius answer, pal. Total genius, but time is running. You think about it. Me, I got a triathlon coming up, and I am in deep training. Bye bye Man, fuck you. Well, you heard him. We've got A, B, and C. Oh, man, look at this. Wow, we can kill Trevor, kill Michael, or Death Wish. Again, I want, to, I want it to be where all three of them uh, make it. Actually, I kind of want to kill Trevor, but... <laughs> um, I want to go for C. We're going to go for C. I got a death wish.
Franklin. Lester, dog. Man, we need to talk. I got a problem I need your help with. Man, actually, fuck it. Man, we all got a problem you can help us with. Calm down, all right? Come to my house. All right, I, all right, I'm coming. Alright, I can't tell which Lester is which. Uh, shit. Uh, which one is it? Okay, assassination and then Lester. It's this one. Okay. All right, ladies and gents, here we go. We have this. We've already made our choice. All right, so obviously you guys know what I've chosen, and I have chosen to hopefully save everybody, because that's usually what I like to do in games. You know, especially the, with the guys that that you play with, the protagonists. I like to keep them all alive as much as possible, so I have the opportunity to play them in the uh, after product of the game. I know that with online, that you actually don't get to play as the characters, but I still want to roam around this world and uh, play. You know, with the characters in the single-player realm, as opposed to the just online. But, um, you know, uh, let me know how it goes when you kill all the other people. Maybe I'll, like, go back and, uh, since you can replay missions, I can, of course, choose to kill Lester, or not Lester, choose to kill uh, Michael or Trevor. The one person I definitely don't want to kill, or have killed, of course, is Franklin. Uh, Michael, I really don't want him to die because I can understand... His situation, you know, he did what he did for his family to get out or whatever, but he never meant for anyone to actually die. Um, Trevor is the one who actually fucked that up. Uh, in the beginning, I wanted Trevor to die because, he, you know, he killed Johnny in the very beginning. Uh, but then I started liking the character and I started feeling sorry for him, but then he did stupid stuff and, um, you know, killed, uh, what's his name and, and his, uh, his girlfriend and whatnot. Floyd and his girlfriend, I didn't really like that. But, um... You know what, this is, it's a game, so I like all three of the characters. I'm really actually glad that they uh, separated the characters and they actually had three separate protagonists instead of just one. Because you definitely uh, got a sense of a bigger story in this than GTA 4. You, whereas, you know, Nico was just kind of going around and just doing errands for anybody. It didn't matter. Whereas these guys, you know, they're kind of, it's different. There's a real, real humanizing story behind it so I think they really kind of up the antics and up the the story and everything with GTA 5 but I'll shut up now because it is time to do this we haven't been to Lester's house since I think the first time we saw him I think it's the next one What's the panic, bro? What the fuck do you think? Man, imagine a fucking scenario that will fuck things up the worst. Boy, my mind is just racing. But you know, I don't want to say something that's really exciting and then you have to act all deflated and say, no, no, it's just that somebody got the same tattoo I got. So why don't you just go ahead and tell me? Some motherfucker wants me to kill Michael. Some other motherfucker wants me to kill Trevor. I feel I can't kill both of them. Man, I'm fucked, man. I don't know what the fuck to do right now. Damn. Well, I can see that. Who are the motherfuckers? Steve Haynes, uh, this angry motherfucker from the FIB. Yeah. Um, Devin Weston, man, you know the... Um, oh, that angry, that, um, rich fucker from whatever hole he hibernates in. Exactly. All right, all right. I say... Kill Michael, then kill Trevor. Oh. Man, are you for real? You're fucked, you know? I, I, I don't know. You know everything, dog. I know, okay, but... I. I I'm sorry, I guess this is it. You know, I'm doing my best, man. I don't know how you can deal with both of them. I know, man. Shit. We're fucked. Every single one of us is fucked. Unless... Okay. Steve Haynes is under a lot of heat because of the shootings at Court Center. 
And Devin Weston is A, known to be a major asshole, and B, known to be friendly with Don Percival, who runs Merriweather. I think, actually, Weston owns a piece of Merriweather. Right, 11%. Pretty good for a pseudo-liberal owning a private army. So, they would both love to be involved in capturing the bullion that we just lifted. If I tell them both that you boys are at the foundry in Marietta Heights melting it down, then maybe, maybe both of them will pay you a visit and bam, we turn it into a, a bust. I ain't got no better ideas. All right, I'm gonna get in touch with Michael and Trevor. You go to the foundry, get yourself set up. I got you. All right. What's up, homie? Man, things are kind of fucked up right now, dawg. It's all good, nigga. Who better to have in a fucked up situation than a fucked up fool like me? Man, that's what the fuck I wanted to hear. Hey, look, I'm coming to your crib to get your ass. I'm here. Uh-oh, something tells me Lamar is gonna die. <laughs> I mean, somebody's got to die, and I'm pretty sure we're probably gonna end up killing Devin and... Steve Haynes. I can't wait to kill Steve Haynes. And Devin, too. Both assholes. I kind of wish Trevor would have been able to get with that uh, attorney girl. That would have been funny as hell. Oh, so sad to be finishing this up. But then again, also really glad to know that I accomplished a game of this magnitude. Um, it's just really accomplishing when you can finish something, upload all the videos. Look how many videos we have. I mean, shit. I mean, almost 60 videos. I'm not really sure how many they are at this moment, but that's a lot of freaking videos and a lot of time to be taken. But it's well worth it. There he is. Where are we going? We are uh, heading to the foundry place. Yeah, I like the bed smelling like sex. Ladies. Hey, look, hear me out, man. If it's too heavy for you, you can back out. No drama. Hit me with it. Man, we got a real problem, dawg. My boys, man. Well, we trying to save them. You actually doing something for your homies for a change? Hell yeah, I'm in. Who want to clap your homies? Who don't, nigga? These Chinese dudes, some FIB cats, the rich white asshole who scammed us on them cars. Devin Weston? That punk bitch? Why didn't you say we was creeping on him? We ain't creeping on him, nigga. At least I don't think he gonna be there. We gotta take all the heat he can throw at us before we worry about how we coming back on his ass. But you is coming back, right? Oh, hell yeah, we creeping on that fool. Oh, so you ain't the mercurial motherfucker you frontin' ass, huh? Man, I'm just trying to make something out of myself, dawg. That don't change who my homies are, nigga. It don't change my family. Shit, nigga, you getting me all emotional now. Nigga might have to stop me from sucking your dick, nigga. Oh, please, nigga, fuck off. <laughs> How many Man, every fool in this town got was somebody in that who want them clap? Yeah, but that applies to some fools more than others. I heard that. Nigga, I'm talking about you. Everybody in this town want to take a pop at your ass. He's lining up, camping and shit, trying to take a shot at the big chick. Ain't that the truth. But ain't nobody pissed off as many motherfuckers as Michael and Trevor, dawg. Shit, nigga, you play big, you stand to lose. Yeah, ain't that the truth. I want to make sure you get all the conversation in. Look, man, Michael and Trevor, they should be inside. Can you stay out here and let us know when the bad dudes is coming? I got it, man. I'll holler at you. Alright, so Trevor and Michael are oh my god, they're aiming at each other right now. This could be it. Our showdown with a private army. And you're bringing a rifle? Yeah, I'm bringing a rifle. It's a good gun. It'll get the job done. That gun? It makes me think this Hey man, what the fuck am I doing risking my ass trying to save y'all ass if you just gonna kill each other? Hey, you're not saving me, you're saving him. Ah, oh, you're saving this fat fuck. Man, y'all gotta keep y'all fucking heads right and end this shit. If not, man, I'll put bullets in both of you motherfuckers. Hey, they here? I know them when I see them, homie. They creep. All right, good. Y'all hear that? 
Now, if we doing this shit, man, it's either now or never. Come on, Trevor. Fuck it! Where do you want me? All right, man. You go over there. All right, where you want me? You hold your position right there. Okay. I'm gonna go over there. You're the building. Watch your sector. Chill, dog. You gotta wait. Wait a second. Oh, we're too late. Ah, that's stupid aiming, man. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to shoot this thing down, but the auto lock just aims right there. See? Or maybe you can't even. I'm already like halfway dead already. That's not a way to start this mission out. There we go. I'm closing him out. Thank you. I can't tell where they're going. Oh, they're above us. That, to me, that looks like you can blow it up, but I guess not. Come on, you punk! Merryweather, coming out the door next to me. Keep your heads. I can take them now. Are they mine? We were waiting. Are you all right? We're ready for ya. Come on. We got some more to deal with. You might be in many weather doing us a favor, taking each other out. How do I get there? I need some help, man, quick. Trying to figure out how to get down. Oh, come on. All right, so it looks like Hold tight, dog, please, hold tight. There's like no down. But SOS, nigga, SOS. I'm trying, but damn it, I had to do that just to get down. I need some help right, right now, homie. Fuck, LD, just hold on, man. Homie, I'm trying to get to you. Hey, these punks causing trouble. There you go. It wouldn't be right if I didn't have to save your ass. Just once. Save me? Nigga, I just wanted some company. Right on two counts, dog. Like every other mark. The metal's meant to be inside, asshole. Two for one, baby. You the new kind of hook, motherfucker. 
No. Really? <laughs> I just can't catch a break. Oh, man. Oh, well. All right. With SOS, nigga, SOS. Hold on, homie. Sound like uh, I'm gonna try to get Dave Chappelle you. there. Hey, these are fools picking on you. There you go. It wouldn't be right if I didn't have to save your ass just one. Yeah, save me, nigga. I just wanted some company. Better not kill him again. There's two of us now. Hit the fucking floor. Good look, yo. Kills an ugly motherfucker. Hit the floor, homie. I don't know how you fools did all your robberies without me. Somehow, shit, we managed, homie. Can you get to him? Oh, yeah. Shit. T, come in. All right, I'm looking for him. Yeah, they're shooting me from all over. It's getting heavy out here, dudes. Can you stop being an asshole, please? To me, T. T. Hill, there's some serious shit going on down here where I'm at. Say something, Trevor. Following him. I can't take too much more of this. I think he's above me. Alright, you guys have fun. They can't keep coming like this. We all are. No, we're not idiots. Help me, you assholes. I'm in your shit. You know. 
What a shootout. So, huh? Oh. What's up? Huh? What's next? Huh? We're just gonna wait around for someone to kill us, or are we gonna wait till this fucker gets turned oh, again, huh? Fight me. Ain't anybody getting turned again, and you know it. Hey, man, the way I see it, we only just begun to clean this shit up. We got a lot of old friends I think need to be re-educated. A lot of friends. I mean, things could get really messy. No, we just gotta silence a few noisy people. <laughs> Hell yeah, let me see. There's, uh... Steve Haynes. Dave Norton. No, we need him alive. Why? So nobody fucks with us afterwards. What about that triad motherfucker? The one that think you two boys is dating? Shit, you know he bound to come back. Yep, there's that. Well, who's the, uh, the guy who set up Lamar? Hmm? Stretch? We wanna throw him in? Shit, Trevor will throw anyone in just to satisfy his bloodlust. Whoa! Hey! It's called a fucking loose end, all right? Now, if we're gonna be men of peace and tranquility, we tie up loose ends. Man, Stretch has been a liability. But then we're gonna have to take care of our old pals Devin Weston and Steve Haynes. Oh, fuck, what a mess, man. Well, let's get it cleaned up. How about you get Lester on the line? Who is this? Uh, stop calling this number. Hey, it's me, dawg. <laughs> You're alive. I thought someone might have your phone. No, nah, no, nah, but look, I got you on speakerphone. Oh, did Mike make it? Yeah, I'm here. And the other one? Mm, see you put in the ground, Wheels. Uh-huh. You, um, just calling for a chat? No, we got some work to do. Can you get us some whereabouts? Oh, I'll do my best. Who? Steve Haynes, to start. And Devin Weston's ass. And, uh, Wei Ching. W-E-I-C-H-E-N-G. Wei Chang! Wei Chang! And Franklin's pal, Stretch. Huh. Stretch? Yeah, man, look, his real name is Harold Joseph. Okay, well, I can tell you that Agent Haynes is taping a show over on Del Perro Pier. Shooting permit came up immediately. Shut it! Oh, I wanted to ice that fucker since the moment I met him. All right, all right. Ah, I got a signal from Mr. Harold Joseph's phone over at the B.J. Smith Recreation Center. No, I got him. I got him. Let's keep him clear of uh, known associates. All right, thanks, dawg. You got it. What you got for me? Tao Ching's credit card just bought a Magnum at the beach club in Pacific Bluffs. Okay, I'll go ask his ass about his punk-ass dad. When I find Mr. Weston, I'll send the coordinates. All right, good. All right, looks like we still got lots of stuff to do here. Alright, let's do this shit. Looks like the last video might be a good, nice, chunky sized video for y'all. Who do I want to be right now? Actually, you know what? Uh. Oh man, I hate that stretch guy. We're gonna be... We're gonna go after Stretch. I just did not like him at all. I don't like any of these villains. I don't like, you know... Any of them, but... Hey! 
Lamar and Franklin send their best. Shady motherfucker. Hey, who this shaky white dude? Okay, I guess that was the wrong target. Dude. Hey, man, he clapped stretch, man. Get him. Pal, stretch. He ain't a problem no more, Frank. See, he wasn't my pal. He was a total cactus, homie. Thanks. That's all we got, man. We got Wei Chang and Agent Haynes on the list. We'll save Devin for the end. No, what did I do? I always, I always hit the wrong button when it comes to uh, the radio. I'm always hitting, I hit down for some reason. All right, we want to save Destin for, or um, him for last, or Steve Haynes, Haynes whatever. You have no idea what that alien got in his alien pants. You understand? No one knows. I don't think this is the right guy we're going after. I think this is his son. Hey, the old man's here. He's leaving the beast club. I'm gonna do it now. Really, I picked the wrong freaking vehicle for this. Really? Come on. Crap, this vehicle's fucked. I can't steer it. I seriously cannot steer this vehicle right now. Oh, this is gonna suck. I've got to be able to get into another vehicle without leaving him too far behind. Come on. You gotta be kidding me. Really? Franklin, you have picked the wrong vehicle for this type of thing. Man, I've died twice now. Alright, we won't take us too far back, I'm sure. Oh, come on. The old man's here. He's leaving the beast club. I'm gonna do it now. Would you kill him already? He got shit. Jeez. I mean, we can escape these guys or we just kill them.
Yeah, w uh, having this bike was the worst thing that we could have done. Triash coming out. We ain't gonna have anyone to sell super weapons to either, but hey ho! Who's next? What happens next is plant Steve Haynes in the dirt. Alright, so we had just been effing up this whole entire mission, but that's alright. I'm sure if you've been watching uh, thus far, uh, then you're gonna enjoy the video. Moving on Haynes. Les, see if you can patch me into his radio mic. I want a last reminder of what an annoying prick he is. Los Santos. A city of saints. A city of sinners. And nothing in between but the FIB. Cut! God, this is crap. Who writes this bullshit anyway? Okay, all right. You got this framed right? Mm, yeah, you're looking great. Is the chin? How's the chin? Oh, sharp. All right, the audio's clean? Nice. Oh, well, say something. Uh, check, check, check. Yeah, it's great. Okay, fine. We're on. I'm ready. You ready? Speed. All right, let's do this, people. I'm a professional. Let's go. <clears throat> Hi, I'm Steve Haynes. Hi. Los Santos. A city of celluloid. Throw in a senior FIB agent. This is a land of dreams. But sometimes those dreams turn into... Cut. Cut. Oh, God, that's a cliche, man. That's a cliche. What? No, I know it's really good. Just do a cutaway. Oh, my God! The guy! What's his name? He shot him! Oh shit. <laughs> Trevor's always really horrible at getaways, so. I wish we'd have been able to say something to these guys instead of just killing them like that. Not taking the chance. Dealt with Haynes. You got a location on Devin Weston yet? Yeah, yeah, I do. Uh, the Merriweather team was dispatched to protect him in his house in the Tongva Hills. Uh, I say house, it's more of a. Yeah, whatever. I'll go up there and get him. All right, this might be it. Black flag. My war. Of course, they saved Devin for the end. Z -z 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 
Bam! Oh, hey, nice. Alright, here we go. Oh, please tell me we can, like, buy this home or some shit like that. All right, this one's not going to be as easy. Hey, unless you got news from the Foundry team, I don't want to be disturbed. Kidnap him. can't go in, we have to go. Oh. Oh, well, something tells me that way is not going to be good. Combat situation. Go Shit. Did not expect that guy to be up there like that. I just put down half your outfit back in town. Have we are from the Well, we tried. We could have done that. Team. Should be only one left. We got through most of them. We could have easily got through all of them, and I do apologize for that. What do you mean all our operatives are dead? Wait, wait, hear me out! Ugh. No more talking! Well, this is it. I, I do apologize. 
That was the perfect Mr. opportunity Weston. for stealth Take and him out of the city, make him kind of failed there in the end. Meet me on the cliffs off the GOH, Chiliad Mountain State Wilderness. We could have easily just been a little bit slower and we would have saw him in enough time. Why can't we just take a plane over there? I like this music though. This is a fine automobile! Good morning. You just woke up in a wrecked convertible. Last night must have been a Let's bring the whoa, 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 what's going on? Where am I? Back. You still don't know what you're getting into, you pal! I'm upset. Pipe down! You upset. My belly bubbling, and I gotta take a crap. You gotta take a crap. My nose running with snot, your nose running with snot. You feel me? Like we can have both for you to burn. I like how the radio station just went out. That was cool. You're a resourceful guy getting past those trained killers. I need someone like you in my organization. The CEO position's gonna be vacant real soon, Slick. I've got nothing against you, apart from the obvious hygiene issues. Michael caused me problems, so Michael had to go. You're looking at it rationally. There are people who are useful to you and people who ain't. And the people who ain't gotta go. Me? I'm not rational. I don't care if you're useful or not. I feel like taking you out, Devo. So that's what I'm doing. This is a serious offer. Work for me. You'll have everything you'll ever wanted. All I've ever wanted is to watch you drift in and out of consciousness as you're slowly disemboweled. Yes! Yes! That's the kind of creativity I need on my team. Come on! Come on! Let me out of here! Look! I got my own company! Trevor Phillips Industries! Oh, yeah, a, a fellow entrepreneur. Let me buy a steak and give you money to grow. I don't know if you heard, but I'm kind of gold rich right now, so you got precisely nothing to offer. Prepare for the end, my friend. I don't lose! Name your price! Go meditate, you phony prick! Well, ladies and gents, it's been a great ride. Just wish this... Whoa! I just wish this last video could have been better. But we have, it looks like, uh... This is why finished the people it. I put in my trunk are usually dead! Really? Who does that in the middle of the road? Gotta love the randomness. You can't do this to me! My friends won't be happy if I empty a clip into the trunk! All right, here we go. You don't even know me. But you're right. You're making a mistake. Here we are, Slick, with a few minutes for some one-on-one -on -one time. Beautiful. Hey, we good, T? Never better, amigo. Good. Franklin? I'll be here. Franklin. Alright, what's up? I assume you got him? Ooh, safe and sound. Ain't that right, buddy? <laughs> hey, my bad, homie. I picked C. Ain't that a bitch? 
Papa. You know, Devin, uh -huh. the way I see it, and hey, I'm no intelligent businessman like you, but the way I see it, there's two great evils that bedevil American capitalism, the type that you practice. Number one is outsourcing. Uh -huh. You paid a private company to do your dirty work for you, and then you underpaid that company because you thought you were big enough and bad enough that you didn't have to play by the rules. Uh -huh. Oh, number two, offshoring your profits. Mm. Offshoring? Oh, it's horrible. You wouldn't want to be sent offshore just to save a little money, would you, T? Oh, no, Franklin? I wouldn't. Oh, no, I ain't would going you nowhere. No, see, but we know your opinions on the matter, Devin. Keep your problems the fuck out of America, huh? <laughs> In this instance, when he puts it like that, it makes sense. Of course it does. Hey, Devin, goodbye, my old friend. Thanks for all the advice. Bye-bye. So now what? Now we keep a low profile and get on with our lives. As friends. Well, do I have a choice? No, not really. All right, then. As uh, flawed, awful, totally uncomfortable, and poorly matched friends. Absolutely. Oh, that's perfect. Then we can get back to the kind of capitalism we practice. Shit, I don't know how much more better that is than Devin's con. Ooh, hypocrisy, Franklin. Civilization's greatest virtue. Jesus, your therapist has a lot to answer for. I know, I still hate myself. But hey, at least I know the words for it now. Yeah, but I hate you, and I know the words for it. So does that mean I don't have to go to therapy? Look, man, you two motherfuckers terrify me of that middle age. I'm good. You're right to be afraid, Franklin. Yeah. Be very afraid, Franklin. <laughs> Tell you one thing, T. I'm getting too old for this nonsense. Oh. All right there, ladies and gents. To live or die in Los Santos. Let's check out some of these uh, achievements here. Wow, only 210 for completing the main game. I don't know if there's anything at the end. So, I want to thank you guys for, you know, just sticking with me throughout this whole walkthrough. Lots of videos, but great content, just great game. Really enjoyed it. One of the best of the year, of course. But we have still got so many more games to come up this year, and it's just going to be a great gaming. is just at its ultimate high right now, and it's just a wonderful thing to do, you know. And uh, I love every single, uh, every minute of it. It's just, it's great to be able to go to work, come home relaxed to a great game and this has definitely been one of those kind of games so again thank you so much excuse me for watching thank you for liking all the videos thank you for everything that you have done for my channel and we're gonna have great games coming up lots of more content on Sinistrain 01 thank you for watching if there's a cutscene in the end or anything like that I'll make sure I'll show it if not we're gonna end it here and hopefully you guys have enjoyed don't forget to just let me know what you thought of the game in the comments below let's discuss the ending let's discuss the different Kind of scenarios or the different endings that you could have thank you again i cannot really thank you guys enough for everything that you do for my channel and i really appreciate it as well so sinistrain01 signing off peace out bitches <laughs>